Hey guys, so a movie, I think, um, if, you, if you enjoy the horror genre or, see it's always really hard because it is classified as a horror, but I feel like you could also say it's a thriller if you really wanted to because it does, like, you are thrilled. Um, so classify it as you want. But movie I think you should go see if you like horror and or a thrill <laughs> is Black Phone. So Black Phone just came out recently and it is based on a short story. Um, and how the director talked about this movie and how he kind of had his own say in it is he also incorporated some own elements like from his own childhood um, and made it his you know kind of his own from the short story um, some elements were changed of course um, with any kind of creative liberty with any story um, <laughs> but honestly this movie kind of had you not at the edge of your seat but you know close to it you were wondering the entire time, okay, what's going to happen? Like, who's on the other end of the line now? Like, how's the phone, you know, like, how's the phone ringing? Like, what's going on? It's a good movie. It's a very much a good movie. I cannot wait until this movie comes out on streaming, until it comes out on DVD, whichever one, one of the two, <laughs> till I can get it, till I can see it again. <laughs> because I am gonna watch it again when it comes time to Halloween. Um, I enjoy a good um, horror movie, especially if it's done well. I don't mind like a slasher film every once in a while, but I like a good psychological, a psychological film too, but um, this one is definitely more, <sighs> It really made me think a lot about true crime. <laughs> it really makes you think a lot about true crime. There's actually honestly one element in here where I'm just like, God, <laughs> that would be me. <laughs> true crime. Um, <laughs> but if you enjoy horror, like this was just a very well done film. I do not know the production value at all of this film, but the fact of the time period that it's set in, where it's set, like based, it just, all of it, I, I think it was very well done. The child actors, I think there's also um, a lot, I wouldn't say a lot of credibility, but a lot to kind of put towards the child actors as well, because in, in some cases, like, they have, I wouldn't say a lot of strain on them, but in this film they did a lot of, like, great stuff. Like, they, the sister was great, the brother was great, the kids were spot on. Like, I commend them. Like, even though you have some adults in here that were, that gave a superb, like, you know, performance, the kids were fantastic, um, and they, they, they really did a great job. Um, I, I loved this film. I loved it. The opening title sequence really made me think of, um, American Horror Story. <laughs> um, if anyone has watched that and kind of knows what I'm talking about, um, it really made me think a lot about it because, like, it gives you snippets into kind of what you're about to watch. Um, and it really made me think about the opening title sequence to American Horror Story. Um, so, it, go see it. <laughs> Period. Go see it. <laughs> Cut. <laughs> but no, seriously, if you, if you enjoy, like, getting a little scared or a little jump here and there, there are a few scenes where there's genuine jump scares. Like, they're not stupid, they're done well. Um, it, it's, it was a good movie. I, I really, I really enjoyed it and I highly recommend it. Um, and, and if you want to wait till it would come out, like it should honestly, with how fast movies are coming out, I feel like it should be out by the time Halloween is here. If it's not, we've got a problem. <laughs>
<laughs> write that down. <laughs> but uh, if you have seen the movie, feel free to leave a comment down below. Tell me your thoughts on it. Um, let me know what you think, and uh, I will talk to you all later. Feel free to like and subscribe if you want, and have a great rest of the week. Bye.